The total cost of ownership, or TCO, for an LLM is staggering. It includes the cost of API calls or the immense capital expenditure for the GPU infrastructure required for self-hosting. For SLMs, the TCO is an order of magnitude lower. Fine-tuning and inference can be run on commodity hardware or much smaller cloud instances. Furthermore, SLMs unlock deployment scenarios that are impossible for LLMs. You can run them on-premise for data privacy and security, in a private cloud for greater control, or even directly on edge devices like industrial sensors or smartphones. This is the classic engineering trade-off. You sacrifice the LLM's broad encyclopedic knowledge for an SLM's blazing speed, efficiency, and deployment flexibility within a specific domain. So how do we choose? It's about matching the tool to the task. Here is a practical decision framework. Start by analyzing your use case. Does the task require broad world knowledge, creative generation, or complex multi-step reasoning across disparate domains? Think of writing a marketing campaign or summarizing a novel. If so, an LLM is your candidate. However, if the task is well-defined, repetitive, and operates within a specific domain, an SLM is the superior choice. This includes tasks like SQL query generation from natural language, sentiment analysis of product reviews, classifying support tickets, or extracting specific entities from legal documents. For these, an SLM will be faster, cheaper, and more reliable. But you don't have to choose just one. An advanced pattern emerging is the hybrid approach, often called a mixture of experts. In this architecture, a very simple, lightweight router model first classifies an incoming request. Based on the classification, it routes the request to one of several specialized SLMs. If the task is too complex or doesn't fit a category, it can be escalated as a fallback to a more expensive, generalist LLM. This gives you the best of both worlds, cost-effective performance for the majority of tasks with the power of an LLM on reserve. To conclude, the trajectory of AI and production systems is clear. We are moving away from the monolithic, one-size-fits-all LLM and toward a more sophisticated, distributed, and efficient ecosystem. The future of enterprise AI is not a single, all-knowing oracle. It is a fleet of highly optimized, specialized agents working in concert, much like the microservice architectures we rely on today. Your role as an architect is to become a portfolio manager for these models. Your challenge is not to find the single best model, but to build a system that leverages the right model for the right job.